Now I have something in my teeth. Damn it! I also have rice. You're gonna have to excuse me because uh, guys gotta eat. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Not sure why Twitch is telling me I've got an unstable connection either. Been pretty, pretty solid. I guess I'm the first one this time. Makoto. You're early, Makoto. Ah, no, evidently not. Listen. Does that mean you feel prepared? Yeah, for now at least. But where's everyone else? Why aren't they here yet? Video feed is black. Ooh, shoot. Why is that happening? I know. There we go. I fucked something up again. <laughs> I'm real good at that. Thank you for alerting me. However, Don't worry, I'm sure they'll be here soon. I'm just like she said. Boing. <laughs> yeah, he's just mad. Boing, boing. They arrived, one after the other. But they were all in the same state of shock. Hina. Hero. Okay, so... It wasn't any normal silence. It was the deafening silence of fear and suspicion. It was like the first class trial. You called for me, so I appear. Starting to think, yeah, so I had a little bit of a, uh, a brainwave happen to me on my way home here because of the, uh, let's call them revelations that happened at the end of last time. With everybody being here and everybody's memories being wiped, that does not totally get rid of the theory that these students are themselves all sort of members of the bad guy group. It just might be that I am one too. <laughs> Maybe we're literally all bad guys. Maybe we went nutso. It's impossible to know these things. It hasn't told us yet. I'm late! Strong Silent Master's wonderful, so cool. So loud, my loins are ablaze. Yes! Now listen, everything will be just fine if you leave it to me. With my scissor sharp sand, scissor, scissor sharp, scissor sharp, scissors. Wow, that's actually what I said. I'll stab and gouge a shit with the master people. But I thought you couldn't kill anyone but adorable little boys. <laughs> well, if that's what the master wants, it can be a boy girl. Anything in between, I can handle it. <laughs> or you know, I can just go back to this meek little hating everybody person. <sighs> no human language can describe the disappointment I'm feeling right now. <laughs> How's oh, everyone here? Oh, and where in our gloomy gus faces, I see. Okay, let's begin. Thrills, chills, the final class trial is gonna be slathered in pitch black despair. Climb maximum sorrow. That's fine. Uh huh, you're right. This is the final class trial, and this time it'll be fair. Hear me, little bear person? I'm going to find you. I mean this time? Stop with all the slander. I'm a bear in good standing, you know. If there were a Mr. Fair Guy Universe Contest, I'd take home the tiara every year. I'm gonna win this game super fair and square. Today, I'm feeling white. And I'll make sure everyone watching at home knows that despair is mightier than the hope. Excuse me, I'm having a beer on the other side of the microphone here. Stop talking. Enough with tedious drivel. Begin trial already. <laughs> sure, sure, let's begin it. Let's begin it already. Just everybody cram yourselves into that elevator. Guys. I made it nice and cozy for you this time. <laughs> Laughing loud as ever, Monokuma disappeared. Ah, whatever. In the name of this will be family. over in no time. With an inexplicable confidence, Byakuya was the first into the elevator. One by one, the others followed. I, the fact that Hina's not saying a damn thing makes me nervous as to what she found, especially since, uh, before that hint, everybody was nice and talkative, except for Hero. He was running away the whole time. But after the hint, everybody was first scared of me, and now they're all super suspicious. <laughs> nobody made eye contact, nobody said a word, they just hey. disappeared in the elevator. They're all acting odd. Like they're paranoid, suspicious of each other. Okay, suspicious of each other, I'm fine with, but I only ever see them reacting to me, so I think it's directed at me. However, but you know why that is, don't you? 
Yeah, I think so. And he can tell us all about it soon, at the class trial. So... Ready to win, right? <laughs> I'm glad to hear you say that. I didn't say anything, I skipped my lines. <laughs> Started making my way to the elevator. There was no fear, no mystery left. And finally, on steady legs, I passed the threshold of the elevator. I'm not. I'm not saying the deeper and the deeper and the despair. Elevator came to an end. Oh wow! Have we actually been going to a different trial site every time? I only noticed that it changed when it went pink, and now. What do you think? Isn't it just the perfect background for deciding a person's fate? Yeah. It's a long-awaited last stage. The always exciting final boss battle. <laughs> oh, and I'm gonna sit in on this one. I'll just sit right here in the vacant 16th seat. Kills, kills, kills. Let's begin! See, here's the thing. That I'm wondering about here. It can't be... Might have to... Throw a wrench in what I said last time. Obviously somebody's controlling Monokuma, but it can't be one of us. Especially if he's gonna sit in on the trial. Like when he was just sitting in the chair. Sure, maybe somebody could have been like piloting him from being in the trial. But if we're all- if he's actively participating in conversation, there's no way. There's no way you could e Somebody has to be up at the remote control site. They can't even do it, like, from- from a little handheld, could they? Alright. Set skills- oh, wait. I fucking have none of these because I haven't been- had a chance to hang out with friends in, I don't know, two months. Let's go over what we got. File number five. Victim's identity is unknown. Dead before the blast. Stabbed a single time, went completely through the body. Struck with the head with an object as thick as a metal pipe. Last time we figured that was arrows. Body was covered with other wounds, but these were at least several days old. Doesn't mean they were unrelated to the killing. Places to check. Several rooms have been locked. The headmaster's room on the fourth floor. Bio lab on the fifth floor. Monokuma door in the data center on the fourth floor. So headmaster's room had... The file. The file with all of our files in it. That's where we got extra information on mystery 16th student, whose name I've already forgotten. Biolab on the fifth floor was the morgue area. Monokuma door in the data center, that's where we found out where he's being controlled from. And the second floor of the dormitory area, where the biggest stuff came from, uh, the fact that uh, both Hiro and Kyoko have been here before. And evidently all of us, but that's where we got the initial hint. In addition, the area is directly connected to Mukuri Ikusaba's death at the garden in the dojo. I'm gonna need to get my other glasses before we get too deep in here, too. Control room. The room in the data center opened to reveal a small room used to command Monokuma. This is where the mastermind had been issuing commands to the Ursine robot. There was also a trap door where the person was located hiding underneath, but we couldn't get into it. Tarp. Found in the garden and played a part in Makura's murder, Biolab had been stamped into one corner. The same kind of tarp was found in the Biolab, so there's no doubt the tarp came from there. However, until that point, that room was locked. The only person who could get into that would be somebody who had the all-access key, i.e. Yoko, or Monokuma, whoever mystery person that may be. Ikusaba's profile, according to the Headmaster report, Makura did not have a single score or wound when she came to Hope's Peak Academy. In addition, her physical features were as follows. Height? Five foot seven, weight 97 pounds, vitals, I still hate that they call it that, 31, 22, 32. Kyoko's confirmed that the corpse matches these characteristics. She could be lying. I don't know. I'm suspicious of everybody right now. I don't want to be suspicious of Kyoko, but she is the one that has, you know, the great, the most crazy spy master access and knowledge of everything. Ultimate despair doesn't refer to a single individual, but a like-minded group of people. One year ago, that group bought about the single's worst event in human history. They're motivated only by despair, making them some of the most specific people to ever live. Hidden room present, uh, Dad Skull. Photo of Kyoko and Headmaster. Headmaster kept a photo of him and young Kyoko together. In the photo, they're both smiling. You can't tell that! It's on the back of his head! 
Headmaster's e-handbook was an emergency key to give access to everything. The handbook apparently has no restrictions, was given to the school's ultimate authority, the headmaster. Locker notebook found on the locker in the second floor of the dorms. Yasuhiro's name was written on the inside and it has notes for a number of different classes. Pocket, uh, locker pocketbook, based on what's written inside, it's believed to be Kyoko's. There's some kind of message scrolled on the last page. Despair walks among us and so we survive. There's a second despair. Maybe Mukuro was the first one. The second one is gonna definitely gotta be some, yeah, Mukuro was like confirmed to be part of the first one, I think. There's a second despair. It might be me. It might not be that I'm part of the bad guy group. It might just be that I am the bad guy group. Amnesia works in weird ways. Biolab secrets seem to have been repurposed as a morgue. Biolab lights. Corpse fridge has been installed in the bio lab. It seems that a blue light comes on to indicate a slot is occupied. The number of blue lights counting the slot for which Makura's body inside comes to a total of nine, i.e. the bodies of every other student that's come here so far. Sorry about my bitrate. Thank you, asshole, who's taking up my uh, fucking... My ability to stream on the finale of an awesome game. Again, just like you did with Xenoblade. And you're gonna, you're gonna be this bad about it too? You're not even gonna let me hold a 1,000 kilobyte. Ooh, don't do this to me right now. Wowzers, wowzers, this is horrible. All right, I'm not sure how much audio is even getting through, but give me a few minutes here. I need to, I need to check this. It won't even let me stay stable at 500. Yep, give me a few minutes here. I need to disconnect and come back on. Wait. Stable? That could have just been a hiccup for a while. Let me try increasing it. Maybe it was. Not sure what's happening. It, it was it was bad for a few minutes. It's, it's still shaky. God damn it. This has been fine for a while again, and now it's just it comes back and strikes again. Inconsistency is the worst type of internet problem to have. It's not going to be perfect, but it looks to be stable-ish if I leave it around a thousand. I'm going to run with this for a while. Let me know if you see a spike down again, alright? Thanks, guys. The number of blue lights counting the slot with Makura's body inside comes to a total of nine. All the students who are dead so far. Group photo. All the Hope's Peak students wearing matching uniforms. Worth noting is that Makuro is pictured while Makoto is not. Did Makuro show up in the videos? Oh, an idea just popped into my head and I hope it's wrong. Could that mean all the others are working together somehow? Actually, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna lean more on that. That the others are working together somehow. Probably is good guys to stop me. Thinking more and more that it's me. This chapter is the first mention of Makuro in the game? No, it's not. She came up in the last one. 
It would seem that while Toko and Genocide Jack share certain fundamental, sorry, Genocide, share fundamental knowledge, their individual memories are separate. Toko's account attests that both the stab wound and the blow in the to the head were inflicted after death. And interview DVD. On a DVD Kyoka found contains interviews between the headmaster and all the Pope's Peak students. Makoto, however, had no such memory of an interview. Thanks to Monokuma's interference, Makoto wasn't able to watch the DVD all the way through. Mmm, please tell me that what I'm thinking isn't true. I don't want that to be true. Alright, let me grab my computer glasses and then we'll, then we'll get this show on the road. Since this will be the final class trial, I've come up with a special rule. So listen up! If you can figure out Mukuro's killer and go on to solve the mystery of this school, you guys win! But if you can't, then I win! And of course, waiting for the loser is the super exciting, super hard pounding punishment! Are you saying that if you lose, you'll execute yourself? Yep, sure will. And that's final? No loopholes? No wiggling out of it later? Of course not! Bears never go back on their word! Never mind all that. I just have one question for you. Oh, you're taking this serious, huh? Are you feeling okay? Is the mastermind only one person? Hmm? Don't bother. I already know the answer. You're all the mastermind, aren't you? You're all out to get me! Thank you, thank you. Mike is off again. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. <laughs> that stupid little red light. I need that to be like this giant blinking sign that pops up over top of it. <laughs> Okay, we already knew his rule. He said that coming in. Hero's right but wrong in his usual dumb way, but I had that same idea so he gets a pass on this one. And then you all said I was muted. Just gonna... gonna take a big old swig of stress juice there. I'm right, aren't I? I knew it! I'm better now, right? Please tell me I'm better now. Group photo, place to check, and headmaster's headroom. You guys have all been working together, haven't you? I have evidence, so I know I'm right. Hey, you stole my line. You're all out to get me. I'm sure of it. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. My mouse wheel isn't working right. I can't... I can't change what the bullet is. I too have evidence to present Is this supposed to happen right now? It, it's it's like glitched. Working together. What? All I've got is places to check. It keeps going away immediately. 
How could the three of us each have that kind of evidence? Is that no to this is supposed to happen or no to is this a glitch? I asked a lot of questions there. All three of them think everybody else is against them. This is no doubt a trap that he set. Should I should should I reload? And set it up so we would suspect each other. And I have something that proves it. You guys have all been working together, haven't you? There, there, there's literally only I'm one thing to shoot. So, right. so I'm I'm gonna just do what I can. What a coincidence. Evidence that proves everyone other yeah, see, that obviously didn't work. <laughs> reload? Reload time. Cool. I've got the evidence. Your guys is fake. Hold on. Let me, let me pause. I'd rather not reload, like, the whole thing, so if I just have to save here, I'll do that. Even though, looks like they don't want to let me do that here. Yeah, all I can do is get at the, uh, the e-handbook. You can't pause mid, mid account. Okay. Uh, let me just, let me just, yeah, reboot the whole thing. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> God damn it. That's three oopses in one stream, and one of them was the game's fault. Okay. Start, load game. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna rush through stuff. Yeah, I say okay, good, I actually did save here. Continue, yep. Nope, already know that. Finish the prep. Skip, 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 skip. Since this will be the fun so if you bought the and are you yeah and the flip 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 Don't you're all the mastermind right up Okay Please work this time I only have the one mouse. You guys have all been working together, haven't you? Cool! My That's game is glitched so here! I can't move my bullet! <laughs> Do I have to use a controller here? You're all out to get me. I'm sure of it. Okay. I can do it with the left bumper. <laughs> I guess I just have to rely on this weird thing now. Everyone other than me has been working together. Bam. I don't think it's my mouse. It's a fine and dandy mouse, but like I said, I only have the one of them. I can't change it. It's not just you three. I have evidence too. What? You too? The evidence you're all referring to is this group photo, right? Well, well yeah. Huh? Wait, but mine's different. Every one of them has not themselves in it. That's what it is. Okay, so it was a... Not necessarily a fake photo, but a doctored one or a custom one just to exclude each student. With the picture you have, I'm in it. But that can't be right. Because in my picture, see, I'm the only one not in it. Oh, so they all have, yeah, so they all have their own. Oh. Shut up, butt vibrations, not now. Nice picture. Figure as much, in which case, you have a whoops, picture too, right? right? Let's see it. Okay, but be careful with it. It's pretty important evidence. This is almost identical to the one that I have. What does Hifumi have like a mirror or something? Why is he always the one in front? So the secret in these pictures has been revealed. Secret or whatever, I don't care. You guys are all in on this together. That's why I'm the only one missing. But you're in my picture. You're the ones trying to trick me. So the whole purpose behind these photos was to get us questioning and fighting with each other. The mastermind laid a trap to make us each think everyone else was working against us. Huh? I laid a trap? A trap? How rude! What grounds do 
you have for such audacious accusation? Look, we just explained it. Proof I need. Each photo has a certain something in common. There's a connection regarding what person isn't shown. And that person is... The ones who got the photos. Simple. In each case, the only one not in the picture is the person who received it. So, in the picture I got, I'm the only one missing. In the picture Hina got, she's the only one missing. Jesus, Sakura, calm down. You're going to bail right over me. I can't take that. <laughs> and in the picture Hero got, he's the only one missing. As long as we're talking about it, I suppose I should show you my photo as well. My photo is just me. <laughs> Everyone else is missing. You are all plotting against words, me. Monokuma gave each of us a group photo in which that person wasn't included. And when we each saw our picture, we just assumed everyone else was the enemy? Yeah, fair. <laughs> Figured it out, huh? Yeah, I thought that must be it. But how was that a hit? Well, I'm not sure that everybody else put together that we used to all go to this school together. There might be more to this than just Monokuma trying to confuse us. There's something else that bothers me about everyone's pictures. What is it? What's digging at me? Can I see everyone's group photo one more time? Yes, it's please. It's not directly connected to what we're talking about, mm. but I'd like to double check something. Sure, no problem. Yeah, I don't mind. There's something unusual about these photos. I need to compare each of them one more time. It was weird that I only saw Jun- I, I didn't see Junko's face in the other two that I got. Fucking Junko's face. Even here where she's looking directly at me, she's being splashed. Also, Sakura, what the fuck? Where, why is that fish in the pool in the first place? Even though Mukurobatsuki, whoever she is, she's definitely there. Even in the swimming pool, Kyoko's wearing her gloves. God damn. And here she's looking away and talking to... I can't remember her name. Little programmer girl guy. Is Mana wearing a Speedo? Wasn't looking at it. Here, Junko's looking away and talking to Celeste. Although Toko over there has already revealed herself as weird psycho killer because her tongue's out. And I thought this was weird the first time I saw it, but I didn't call it out there. Why is Taka's... No, maybe I did. Taka's arm is directly in front of her face. <laughs> There's something strange about all of them. Something I can't quite pin down. No, I, I know what it is. Can you just forget about the photo already? Although, let me check. Can, can I actually go back through the photos again? <laughs> I, I want to see if Mondo was in fact wearing that Speedo. Group photo. Can I? No, it won't let me flip through them. Ugh. Trying to trick me with such an obviously fake photo. I'm still pissed about that. She was also the first one to die, and very stupidly. That might have been intentional. And on top of that, they went to all that trouble to make it look like we were wearing matching uniforms. Hmm? So you think they're fake? <laughs> no, 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 I assure you, they're quite real. But, but what are you talking about? There's no way! Mm. Yeah, I don't remember ever taking a picture like that, so it's gotta be a fake. I'm sure of it. This is where we gotta bust it to but him. You know, can we really be so sure? Huh? Don't get me wrong, I don't remember taking this picture either. But, is that really enough to be absolutely positive they're fake? What do you mean? The reason I don't remember the picture isn't necessarily because it's fake. There might be some other reason. An unbelievable but not entirely horrifying reason. Yeah, we went to this school and we all got a group amnesia. Amnesia. Yep. <clears throat> Give me an M. Gimme an M. Gimme that M. 
Fuck off. I didn't miss anything. Uh. Damn it. Now I understand. 